All right, well, hopefully the recording is actually doing well. So I actually did play this game already. I uh, was trying to do the forest section. Oh, I should have mentioned, but if you go to the corner to the right behind the poster for Almora, there is a secret switch that will show you a bunch of, like, black light stuff. Maybe we'll come back to it later. Maybe I'll edit it in. If I can figure, if I can figure out how to, like, do this. You know, again, this is one of my first videos. I'm just testing the water, seeing how I can do recordings and such. So, for now, uh, enjoy. Okay, so I already went through a bunch of this stuff already, but... I guess let's just go. I don't want to do the whole bottle Easter egg. I'm going to call it Easter egg. I'm kind of used to calling these kind of secrets Easter eggs. Um, I used to be part of this Call of Duty community, and it was all just Call of Duty zombies, Easter eggs, and so at this point in my life, I feel like anytime something is secret, I just it's just an Easter egg. It's Easter egg. But yeah, you can find a bottle here, and that is all I'm going to say. Oh, uh, whatever. I mean, you, you'll, if you want to try this game, you do it. I already did it. I spent like an hour doing this. Just exploring everything. So, let's actually just cut straight to the portion that I wanted to film here. And get there, get there. Okay, so the reason I'm coming down through here is because if you go through here... Okay, we're going to go over there. And, and you know, that's terrifying. I do not like the idea of going over there. Uh, but there is something interesting if you head in this direction first. Oh, wait, I'm in the... No, I'm in the right place, actually. If you come this way and haha, -ha, play the game home, or, or just home, I guess or whatever the symbol means. I actually do not know what that symbol means anymore. I guess you can say I'm kind of out of it. So... Yeah. Anyways, if you come in this direction... And if you go a little bit far, you'll eventually hit a wall that you just can't get through. And again, I'm doing this all unscripted, so I really don't know what I'm supposed to be talking about. So I'm just kind of rambling, sorry. But, you know, I will tell you right now that seeing anything Henry Langan related, like, visually, is such a treat. Simple because there's not that much media, like there's a few pictures every now and then, there's the music video, which I, if you ever want to know more about this, go watch down on YouTube. Uh, it's this music video, it's literally just called Down. Just look it up, Bend Down, Down, whatever you want, and you know, you'll find it. You'll know it when you see it. And it's just like, anything visual is always so good just to decipher to look at okay here's the thing i don't know if it'll pop up in fact he did not pop up actually which is weird because he popped up the last time so i really don't know what to expect God, I really thought he would pop up if I went in that direction. Or maybe he'll pop up somewhere else. If not, I am just going to go through here. And I do not know if you can tell, but I am actually scared. I am... I love the fact that I supposedly love horror. 
And I love horror games. I, I do. I can't say I don't. But, like... I have a hard time... Oh, well, that is a wobbly... Wobbly branch. Uh, yeah, I have a hard time getting through horror games. But I, I will push myself for something that I really like. And there we go. There we go. There goes the tree. As to the loading screen, I'll probably cut this out. <sighs> terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Okay, press the any key. Where is the any key? I love saying that. Anyways, okay, here we go. Back in the manor. Back in the manor. So I think this is kind of based off this mob called Cog's Mob. You can find this mob on YouTube, though I will say that it's kind of hard because it's kind of been buried, and you're gonna find a. The algorithm is going to show you a lot of stuff. But oh, you know what? I might actually link post a link in the description full of a bunch of stuff if you want to get it more into this kind of like into this kind of world of Henry Langham so if you're interested in that check the link because I will post a bunch of stuff there notice like the the sky got a lot more fiery I wonder if this was like the interpretation that this is taking place during the Drowning in Paris song. Or, again, uh, it could be, it might not, this game is fan-made, so I think a lot of it is up to their own interpretation. Since there isn't as much canon information available to solidify whether something is 100% correct or not. Well, anyways, I should go in here anyways, I'm, I'm putting it off. I'm, like I said, I am scared, so I do not want to open that door. I know there's jump scare here, and I'm just going to let you go through it. Uh, it's not even that loud, and I'm fucking terrified. Uh, let's, let's look at some radio messages before I do anything else, because I don't know how important this is going to be, so... Uh, general, blah blah blah, blah blah blah, records, radios, okay. Everything's going to plan. Now what you have to do is go for the map. Look around, if there's a puzzle, you'll have to solve that puzzle and find a key. Once that key is found, the creature on the field is used. I'll recognize this creature. We will give you the tools to find out what's going on. You're going to have to run. Now what you have to do is get to the right spot, you will find a chain. Okay, so the funny thing is I did not understand a single word, except you'll find the creature, find the key, and, uh, yeah, find a creature, find the key, or find the key, then the creature, okay, uh, oh, I'm fucked, aren't I? 
Okay, if I remember the conks. Oh, all oh, the spheres! Oh, that is so cool. I am not gonna lie. I. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna stay up here because it is safe. Okay, so. Oof. This is terrifying because. Oh, you know what? This is actually more terrifying than the actual audio. Again, because there's actual visuals now. So, if you've ever listened to Cogsmov, there is a sequence where f a bunch of balls are activated. And this person enters a manor, a lot like this one, this is probably just a recreation of it. And there's a bunch of mosh surrounding the person. Which is why I find this terrifying, because if this is the actual room, then the mosh might not be that far. So I'm gonna wait for this to like clock out. Okay, so I think that's just an audio loop. So I don't think the mosh are gonna pop out. But you can never be too certain. You know how it is with horror. I, uh. Again, I'm not good with it. But. Okay, I think I've cowered enough. I'm gonna. But gee, god, that's. That's cool, actually. Okay, there are three different endings in the Cogs Moth. So, I'm gonna kind of explore here a little bit. See if there's anything I can do. Don't touch, okay. So I do gotta be careful. Because... Thanks, Hale. I wonder who that is. Oh, no. No, it's a radio. Radio messages is gonna add it to your records. I kinda wanna listen to it, but I also kinda don't. I don't trust like that. And I just realized there's a whole another switch here. And I'm going to hit that, and I'm gonna run away. Because I do not know what's there. Oh gee, oh heavenly Jesus, I am not strong enough for this. I am not brave enough. I am definitely not brave enough, but you know. Okay. Okay, so if I recall correctly, in the story, the mosh surround the narrator and the narrator kills them all and when he does one ball leaves and goes into another room and one of these doors opens so I don't know if this is gonna be like the story where the door itself will unlock Oh, God. Okay, you know what is terrifying about this? I cannot tell what's in there. There is no lighting in there. Is that a light? Okay, so... Yeah, I do not want to go in there. But I suppose I really don't have any choice, do I? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, save me! Yo, yo, Paraka! 
I mean, uh, okay, that's just me talking nonsense. Because that is how I cope with fear. I talk nonsense, and I sing nonsense songs. And I make references to old, old school Lego. So yeah, yo yo, paraka. <laughs> oh no, is that a loading screen? Oh. Flashback River. Oh ho oh, oh. ho. Stare at the face of the mushwash dog. Never again will they leave. Take a look at their face and explain what did you hope to achieve. Look at his face. This is the price you call free. Listen to me. Look at his face. This is the price. Uh, something something prepared for sour carry. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, but this is still really cool. Now, honestly, if I had to say, the graphics in this game fit the Z. Okay, I've been calling it Z, but it's Z. I guess it's the British way of saying Z. But honestly, it fits. So, like, yeah, I really like this. Oh, there's a note. Can I get the note? Uh... There's a note! Okay, uh, let's, let's read the letter. We just found a letter. We just found a letter. We just found a letter. Let's see who it's from. Oh, Michelle Parker. Who knew it? He knew it. Wait, what is that? Is that? No, it can't be. Oh god, he's coming from Grand yeah, Sons and Sil. Oh, this reminds me of the beta version of Z3, which is known as Zombies 3. So, I guess we'll go back into the house, into the manor. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, this isn't zombies. This is not Call of Duty Zombies, but that sound is very reminiscent to it. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Hello, Mr. Oh, Matt! Haven't heard that name in a while. Okay, uh... uh, uh. Engel's office is here? Oh, I guess he's a member- Oh, this is- Oh, that is an interpretation of- Oh, wait, wait, wait! Okay, so it's really funky because, okay, so many of the characters do not have physical appearances. 1952, that's interesting. That's a year. God, was Engel actually active in 1952? I actually don't know. Okay, every time that mute, the chiming just gets to my head, I'm just like, oh, that's crazy. I do not. Okay, we'll take the pen. Let's look at his journal. And that was it. I didn't care that what he was going to ask. I didn't care if what he was saying was going to kill me. All I wanted was the pain to go away and find the man who killed him. Angle probably who would help me find them. Ugh. Oh, I guess I'm out the door again. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I fully expected there to be a mosh behind the door. Like that. Okay, this is terrifying because I do not know what to expect. Although, I will say my tolerance for horror gets better, I guess. 
the more I'm exposed to it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this is interesting. What is this supposed to represent? Is this like... Okay, so I actually, I'm not British, so I don't know what Alton Town is. But I assume this is London, because the sirens are going off. Oh my god. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll go this way then. <gasps> oh, that guy. Who are you? You are scripted to do something, aren't you? I got my eye on you. If I just kill him. Wait, there is something there, I just can't tell what that is. Wait, there is something there. What is going on here? Is he going on chunk? Okay, so I guess for context... Okay, I've been spitting a lot of context here. But the Mosh have two types of modes, I think, or maybe three. One is on shock and the other is like on lock. On shock, I believe, is when they're receiving orders. And on lock is when their mission is done. And they stand completely still. So... Oh. You know, I honestly don't even know if my equipment is still recording at this point. Again, I'm just testing, but I kind of hope it's still recording because I kind of I am in, I I am enjoying doing this recording. I guess I could go back to the door then, but there's always a queue. Okay, that looks familiar for some reason. The trash looks very familiar. Hello? I don't know what that is, but... Okay, I'm just gonna assume he's going on, on shock. Okay, that's it. That's all I can do here. I'm just going to go to the next segment. Every time I go through that door, I feel like I'm going to die. I can sing songs too, I just don't know how to... I'm not musically talented, but I will sing. I, I like singing. I enjoy... Uh, Oh my god. Okay. I will tell you right now that I do enjoy singing. I... Uh, is the shuffle better than... Oh, oh, what is in there? Can I leave? You do not have briefcase with my- okay, that's another Henry Langham reference. And there's another door. Mission on repeat. Mission is complete when the girl died. Oh, the light flickered. I do not know. I do not like this. 
I do not like what I might find here and oh ho 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 Great, I love doors. I love doors. Oh, that is sick. Oh, I get it now. That was the killer. That's why he was like that. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that makes sense now. That makes complete and total sense. Oh, that is good storytelling right there. Please, can I go home now? Okay, that was scary as shit. I... Is that it? Okay, uh, okay, I'm just gonna... Skedaddle, skedoodle. <laughs> I'm just a scared noodle. No, seriously, I am scared shitless right now. I am going to just keep talking because the more I talk, the less I'll be scared. Okay, no, that's a lie. I am terrified. I'm going to be keep being scared whether I keep talking or not. So you just have to keep listening to me. And nope, I am not going in there. Or maybe I can just... Oh, 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 I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, it's the gray room. Okay. <gasps> oh! I want the lights to turn back on because I am just a scared old smith. And I'm sure they want me to wait wait a minute. I have a lighter. Mission on repeat. Mission is complete. Okay, no, mission is not complete. Because I do not want to go outside on the hillside. Mission is complete. I don't even want to look because I'm kind of terrified. I am so goddamn terrified. Okay, no. I will do it. I will do it. Nope. I can't go that way. I'm not gonna lie, at this point, I kind of want to exit just to make sure things are still being. Okay, I really hope my audio is coming out fine, because if this commentary gets cut, I'm going to be a little sad. I mean, my commentary isn't great. I mean, I, I know other people can do this a lot better than I can, but wait a minute. 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, nope, nope, never mind. Never mind. Sorry, Henry, I don't have a briefcase for you. So the only thing I can really think of doing right now is going back into this room and going back into the mushroom, but down my spine. Okay, there's actually one door I have not tried yet. So I guess I should try it now then. It's one not too far from here. Okay, I really wish... No, I actually can't open that. I think I'm just stuck. Although there was another me another message here. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, that was not. Maybe this is a different room. No entries. Okay, I don't think I should be playing that because that is kind of copyrighted music, I think. Does that count as copyrighted music? Okay. Uh, I'm just going to do that. Okay. Uh, Wait a minute. Oh, do not touch. Okay. I'm just going to touch it. We've come so far. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, okay, so I am not the Lincoln Park person. That is another friend of mine. Although I do like Lincoln Park, more or less. Oh, well, look at that. Look at that skybox. Ooh. 
Okay, seriously, I am very lost right now. I can't go back in here, so... I can't go back now. Oh, what did I get myself into? I guess I'll just go back into the apartment and see if I can maybe find the key. Oh, that is fucked up. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what, what happened here? I did not notice that. There's so many layers to this. Wait a minute, I just realized he's the same... He, I think he's the same model as... The Mosh in that room, in the gray room. And again, this is probably just because it's a demo, there's probably no actual... Oh, oh, and... Yep, that's it. You know what? I think that's the cue that this playthrough is over because, okay, I love this. I guess I'm drowning in the lake. Uh, well, well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed my Let's Play of ZFG. If you're interested in that, I'll leave some links in the comments section or, I don't know, description. Check either one. Anyways, uh, bye, everyone. Bye.